worksheet 5.1 I I gave you the gist for Merchant of Venice I thought that worksheet should be uploaded so uh, the exam got postponed <laughs> that is also there I thought I should do it but by then exams also got postponed please do learn well children okay the first one is to make something less harmful okay second one confiscate to take a possession away from someone okay third one uh, we have the word president a simple action that happened after he he contrived his contrived behavior was hated by all unnatural it is very immature to fight over trifling issues so your trifling is insignificant that's all and then you have one portia's uh, content over here her um, her story like a soliloquy is said you know what is called soliloquy actually soliloquy is um, the character will talk on the stage but the character's speech will not be heard by uh by the people on the stage but it is the the speech heard by the audience okay that is called soliloquy she will talk to herself but it will be loud the thing is it will not be heard by the um the characters on the stage but it will be heard by the audience that is called soliloquy and we can uh, see that they have given you a beautiful question also over here imagine you are a present age portia how will you deliver <coughs> so this is an imaginary thing your question your answer can be of any sort okay so you think of one small uh, incident and how will you handle that incident that is how you should write this answer you will not get such kind of questions in the exam so you need not worry and next we can see dramatize the play this is very important because five mark answer many a times we have seen this question this been posted in your exams so here is a question like between two students at a book fair i have just written for you just follow me though you cannot understand my writing i am reading it for you just to make sure that you are copying it down and keeping it and make some changes with it if you want and write it in your exam ramesh hi suresh nice to see you here suresh hi ramesh what a what a great surprise mesh when did you come by 3 o'clock so uh, by 3 o'clock ramesh okay actually it is ramesh ramesh oh i uh, oh that's nice i came by 2:30 suresh oh okay what books have you have you bought ramesh i have bought some classics Oh Can you tell me which stall you bought it Ramesh in stall number 5 Okay I would also buy them Ramesh they have discounts too you can get them Suresh Oh okay Ramesh thank you very much so very nicely this uh, conversation is going on very simple conversation you should see to that you are writing it very simply and easily okay don't try to mess up things children uh, to the question asked you can see very simple english only i have written i, I did not write anything uh, much difficult sentences for you very easy sentences i thought i should frame it out for you okay this is one question of exercise c then uh, we have uh, the next question that is it is uh, between a customer and a sales domestic appliance shop sales person okay so with this uh, in the sales person i thought i i have an answer for you i thought i can show that you can just copy it and keep it okay so that will be a useful thing so here i am bringing the answer for you yes a customer and a sales person okay uh, shopkeeper welcome to our shop sir customer thank you how can i help you sir i am looking for a good washing machine sir automatic or semi automatic sir what is the difference between automatic and semi automatic fully automatic machines does everything sir if you have to just load your clothes and then press a button it will finish everything whereas semi automatic machine requires some manual input when doing laundry because it has several tasks before laundry is done 
ओके थैंक यू सर लेट मी गो इन फॉर ऑटोमेटिक मशीन सर सो दिस इज इज ट्राइंग टू से एंड सो वाट्स अ नेक्स्ट थिंग यर वी हैव शॉपकीपर सर सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव के जी फुली ऑटोमेटिक टॉप लोड वाशिंग मशीन कॉस्ट ट्वेंटी टू थाउजेंड सर ओ साउंड एक्सपेंसिव हाउ अब सेमी ऑटोमेटिक सर सेमी ऑटोमेटिक टॉप लोड मशीन वाशिंग मशीन इज ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड सर ओ द डिफरेंस इज जस्ट टू थाउजेंड रुपीज आई विल गो इन फॉर ऑटोमेटिक टॉप लोड वाशिंग मशीन सर काइंडली शो मी द वेरियस ब्रांड्स ऑफ वाशिंग मशीन सर देर आर मेनी ब्रांड्स सर दिस इज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट एंड फास्ट मूविंग मशीन सर Do you have any warranty for this product? Yes, sir. We give three years warranty on this. All right. Kindly, kindly pack this one. Okay, sir. Thank you. So this is your uh, answer between a shopkeeper, my dear salesman. I have just made it as a shopkeeper for you. So you can rewind this, write it, and keep it, and so that you can use it for the exam. Next one, we have between a student and a parent during college admission. Father, it is better you choose B A English. No, dad, I, I am a, no, dad. I am willing to choose BA Economics. Actually, and you need not write. I am willing to choose BA Economics. Wow, Economics is also a wonderful course. Why do you want to choose BA Economics? Okay, so this is a, a sentence over here. I'll just turn the page. I've just made it for you, students. I have uh, uh, printed out. You can because instead of writing, I thought I can print it out for you. So. that i wish to be an economist and make my country the developed one why do you say so no dad a great grandfather studied that india was a developing country my grandfather also studied in his history book that india was a developing country and i am certain even you would have studied the same during your school how long are we going to say our country has been developing at least the future generation should study in their history books that indian is and india is a developed country not indian okay indian india is a developed country wow awesome my dear son i feel proud of you by the way dad why did you ask me to choose ba english literature that's a good question my dear son i wanted you to study ba english literature but then your grandfather did not allow me to study ba english literature your grandfather wanted to see me as a doctor that is why i am a doctor at government hospital today oh dad fathers are always forcing their dreams on their children okay dad tell me why did you ask me to choose ba english literature it is a course where you will learn how to lead a life happily you will learn the impermanence of life cultures of various countries you can enhance your communication skills etc son oh dad interesting to hear i feel like choosing both ba english and ba economics yes son you can not have the option called dual course year choose one course year and learn learn course through distance mode the other course through distance mode all right dad give me some time dad i will think about it and let you know dad okay my dear son so this is all it is and next we have complaining about the food so food delivery good morning sir i have reached your address good morning sir may I may i know who is this sir i am from sapte par romba jor hotel it seems that you have ordered food through our app oh yes have you reached my place i am waiting outside your house not my house your house sir kindly share your current location sir your location ends here sir is it okay okay this is the fourth one is it okay yes 
so let me tell you the answer next my app says your current location is 1 kilometer away from here sir anyway kindly wait sir okay come fast so food delivery agent says deliver the food packet and leaves thank you opens the parcel and calls him again sir where are you you have mistakenly delivered non-veg biryani i have actually ordered a curd rice as my stomach is upset so kindly check your ordered item sir you have ordered chicken biryani sir hello i am priyan i guess you have mistaken delivered priya's order sorry sir the name confused me sir so sorry for the inconvenience cost it is already 2 30 when you will come again kindly accept my sincere apologies sir i will be there in a jiffy sir please come fast i am already starving and famished extremely sorry sir i will be there in no time very kind of you sir okay this is your ordering dialogue so actually you have it in your books these two um, this is the one domestic uh, between the salesperson and the next one is a student and a parent during college admission and we have the third question i mean one more question which says complaining of the food okay one minute it is getting has to capture so i have given you answers for all the three okay uh four i have given you answers for all the four ah here it has come here you could see complaining to the food delivery agent so everything is over and now the next question over here is we have the next lesson next lesson goes with entry four part one Okay, I will upload it in the next video. Thank you students.